Good morning, dear students. Today we are going to start with a new chapter, geometry, chapter number twelve. Okay. So today we shall learn about the basics of geometry. See, I have prepared something for you. You need to write these in a copy today. Okay. These are the basic things. that you must have learned in the previous class just remind it okay geometry so today we will be learning few basic thing about geometry which are points line line segment ray parallel line intersecting line perpendicular line and at last angles okay so today let's look at these one by one okay what is a point a point indicates a position in space it has no length no breadth or thickness clear like this is the example point m point n and point o like this okay points can be there on the line and in line segment or in angle also okay so this is applicable everywhere now next is line a line extends endlessly in both the directions it has no length or end points okay for example look at this line see when you'll find arrow on both the sides it indicates it is a line okay a line ab we can read it like line ab or line ba clear now let third is line segment a line has a fixed length and has two end points here it should be a line segment clear a line segment has a fixed length and has two end points for example line segment ab we can read it like this ab or ba look at the symbol it is simply a line segment it is a part of a line a line segment is a part of a line okay now next is ray a ray has one end point and extends indefinitely in other directions in other directions clear it contains many points in it okay like look at this example a ray x y we can read it only x y not y x clear see this is the symbol of an arrow this arrow shows single side arrow shows a ray a ray x y clear next is parallel line when two lines do not meet and remains at the same distance from each other when two lines do not meet and remains at the same distance from each other we can say that this is a parallel line one more very important thing about parallel line is a parallel line never meet or you can say the parallel lines never meets okay see this is the example of parallel line when two lines remains at इक्वी डिस्टेंट फ्रॉम ईच अदर ये दोनों एक दूसरे से बराबर की दूरी पर रहेंगे हमेशा के लिए क्लियर ए बी इज पैरल टू सी डी सी दिस इज द सिंबल ऑफ पैरल ए बी इज पैरल टू सी डी क्लियर सो दिस यू हैव टू कीप इन यू माइंड वाइल डूइंग दिस चैप्टर ओके नेक्स्ट इज इंटरसेक्टिंग लाइन्स वेन टू लाइन्स मीट एट वन पॉइंट वेन टू लाइन्स मीट एट वन पॉइंट or intersects each other at a point clear see here line mn meets to line pq at a point x so we can say that line mn and op are intersecting lines clear next perpendicular lines when two lines intersect and makes right angle between them when two line intersect and makes a right angle between them see here line ab intersect line cd and makes a right angle right angle is 90 degree right angle between them 
so we can say that a as c angle a as c is a right angle or 90 degree clear so here we can say that line ab is perpendicular to line cd or we can say that line cd is perpendicular to ab clear now next is angles about angles we will be studying in the in details in this chapter but you just learn what is an angle when two rays meet at a point when two rays meet at a point see here ray ray these two rays are meeting at a point and creates a vertex this point becomes a vertex and here you can find this is the angle and these two becomes an arm of an angle so here when two rays meet at a point creates an angle between them so we can say that angle this look at this example we can say that angle a b c clear so these are the basic thing that you should know before starting this chapter so today you have to write all these things all these basic things in your notebook okay next day we will start exercise 12.1 okay so till then bye bye thank you